So my friends, now for something a little different. A little more. Help me sing. Listen. I found my thrill. I found my thrill on Blueberry Hill. On Blueberry Hill. On Blueberry Hill. When I found you. When I found you. The moon stood still. The moon stood still. On Blueberry Hill. On Blueberry Hill. It lingered until. It lingered until. My dreams came true. My dreams came true. My name is Andy Tubman. Uh, I am co-founder of Musical Health Technologies, and I have been a practicing clinical board-certified music therapist for over 15 years. Um, and though it seems fun to sing Blueberry Hill, what has now been proven is that it is actually a whole brain neurological workout that integrates timing centers, language centers, right? And what just happened that has also been proven is you released serotonin, endorphins, oxytocin. That, applied in the right way, helps to elevate mood, reduce pain, and increase social connection. If you don't want to take my word for it, take a look at Gottfried Schlag's work, Neurology at Harvard, who has now proven using fMRI machines that um, he's proven that singing, different kinds of singing protocols, rewires damaged portions of the brain, increasing the mass of the Broca's area from singing protocols, okay, for with uh, aphasic patients. Or take a look at Ani Patel's work in, in uh, music cognition at Tufts, of which um, when Ani is asked what part of the brain lights up with the fMRIs when singing, he says, everything above the shoulders. Right? So, um, that said, there's only 6,000 certi board certified music therapists. It is a challenge to fund and to quantify and especially to scale. Right? Um, so, what we've done is we've set out to create a new industry, one that uses singing and music as a standardized healthcare tool. Okay? Um, so, we're focusing on elders because we think that there's the greatest need in the market, the greatest need of the folks, and also we think we can do the, the most good there. Um, understand that for the first time in the history of human life, we understand what's going on or we're starting to understand what's going on inside the brain and we think that we have come up with a solution that actually, um, that actually is able to, on a mass scale level, wield the power of music in the face of an oncoming tidal wave of dementia. Um, the way that we've done this is first we've created technology. We've created an app using a word queuing system, eliminating all, any need for visual, no lyric sheets, right? So everyone's spontaneous. Side note, we got a mention in an ARP bulletin a month or so ago, and that mention at the end of an article shot our app up to number 15 on the health and wellness charts in iTunes. Um, the next thing that we did was we have a great team of music therapists and we've created um, really brilliant programming combined with the technology and it's, it looks a little like this. We have thematic playlists that are integrated, that are threaded with trivia as well as movements. And you go in and you go into a senior care community or a one-on-one -on -one situation and what that enables the training, that what that enables the folks at a senior care community or a home health uh, company, home caregivers, what that enables them to do is to create really successful musical experiences consistently. Um, let's take a look at what a group might look like. And one of the people that, the, one of the most famous, famous trumpet players from New Orleans Sachmo. grew up there, Sachmo. Sachmo. 
Exactly. Oh, yeah. So our first song today will be a really famous Satchmo song. And it's called When the Saints Come on. You got it. Here we go. All you need to do is listen to the words and sing along with me, please. Please sing out and have fun. Oh, when the saints, oh, when the saints go marching in, go marching in. Oh, when the saints go marching in, oh, when the saints go marching in. Lord, how I want to be in that number. Lord, how I want to be in that number. When the saints go marching in, when the saints go marching in. Yes, thank you very much. Cheers. So I'd like to take the last couple seconds here to announce that um, over the last couple weeks, we've been greenlighted for two clinical uh, studies, one with Ani Patel at Tufts University, looking at typical brains over 55 on singing, sync fit, and uh, cognition and memory. And the other one is with the Alzheimer's Association of Scotland, which I can't wait to go to. Um, <laughs> so to achieve our goals, we have created, we have made brilliant partnerships with some really interesting companies, the DOD to uh, Warner Chapel Publishing. And um, if you would uh, like to be a part of creating a new industry where music is medicine, please give us a call. Here's information. Thank you all very much.